Hey everyone, this is Nate from Get VoIP, and today we're going to compare two of the most popular video conferencing platforms on the market, Cisco WebEx and Zoom. Let's get right to it. Both WebEx and Zoom offer Unified Communications as a Service, or UCAS, which means they combine voice over IP, team chat, and video meetings into one interface. They have similar features like HD video and audio, screen sharing, waiting rooms, recording, virtual backgrounds, live captions, and breakout rooms. But how do they differ, and which one is better for your business needs? Let's find out. First, let's talk about the phone system. Both WebEx and Zoom offer unlimited calling in the US and Canada, as well as auto attendance, voicemail, and call controls. However, Zoom has some advantages over WebEx in this area. For example, Zoom offers call monitoring, which allows supervisors to listen, whisper, join, or take over calls. Zoom also offers more options for international calling, such as domestic plans in other countries and unlimited calling to 19 countries as an add-on. Zoom also has cheaper phone-only plans, starting from $10 per user per month, while WebEx's cheapest plan is $17 per user per month. Next, let's look at the team chat. Both WebEx and Zoom have built-in team chat on desktop and mobile, with group and private messages, file sharing, and reply options. However, there are some differences in the chat functionality. For instance, WebEx allows users to send audio and video messages, which can be useful for quick communication. Zoom, on the other hand, has an AI companion tool that can create messages, summarize them, and even summarize entire conversations. Zoom also has more formatting options for text, such as bullet points, numbered lists, and font colors. Now let's compare the video meetings. Both WebEx and Zoom offer HD video conferencing with desktop and mobile access, invite codes, chat, custom layouts, noise removal, polls, whiteboards, transcripts, interactions, and live streaming. However, some features set them apart. For example, Zoom has live captions that can translate into other languages, a built-in note-taking window, and an AI companion that automatically summarizes meetings and creates highlight reels. WebEx, on the other hand, has live video streaming. WebEx supports up to 1,000 participants, and Zoom supports up to 500. Now let's talk reporting and analytics. WebEx provides real-time queue analytics, allowing supervisors to monitor call volumes, wait times, and agent availability. Historical reporting captures data on call quality, user activity, and meeting participation. Customizable dashboards display key performance indicators, or KPIs, in various formats. Zoom also offers detailed analytics. Call logs and usage reports track call history, meeting attendance, and chat activity. Queue analytics, which are available as an add-on, help monitor call performance. Zoom's extensive integration ecosystem further enriches its analytics offerings. Finally, let's talk about the integrations. Both WebEx and Zoom integrate with many third-party apps, such as CRM tools, collaboration apps, calendaring tools, and productivity apps. However, Zoom has more integrations than WebEx, with over 1,000 integrated apps, while WebEx has roughly 400. Zoom's integrations also support a wider variety of chat and phone functions, while WebEx's integrations mainly focus on video features. So which platform is better for you? Well, that depends on your preferences and priorities. If you need a more robust phone system, more AI chat support tools, more video meeting features, and more integrations, then Zoom might be the best choice for you. If you need a larger video meeting capacity, live video streaming, advanced phone features, and audio and video messages, then WebEx might be the best choice for you. And of course, both platforms offer free trials and demos, so you can test them out before you decide. If you found this editorial informative, give it a like, smash the subscribe button, and hit the notification bell below to keep up with our journey to simplify the VoIP world. Till next time, this is Nate from GetVoIP.